You guys, good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. It's so good to see you. Welcome to Planet Fest 2012, the most exciting place to be on Earth. And I think, really, if you're going to continue breathing, well, I'm going to include Mars. This is still, for me, the place to be, but we are going to Mars tomorrow night. We're on our way right now, and you all are very much part of it. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, I want to thank our members of the Planetary Society for your longtime support allowing us to put on this, this uh, wonderful event this weekend. And I, I guess I should take a moment. Let me thank all of our sponsors. The Jet Propulsion Lab, fabulous. Uh, you may have noticed SpaceX. SpaceX is here. Cool. I went down, I went down to SpaceX a couple weeks ago, and I'm just, are there, I'm the oldest guy here, aren't I? Yeah. No, it's great. And then uh, X-Core, did you see the links? Fabulous. It is the achievement of a dream, a rocket-powered plane that leaves a runway, goes into space, comes down. And then ATK, the, uh, the rocket company that uh, builds the boosters that we've all relied on for so many years. So thank you all. Th thanks to everybody. Uh, it's going to be a very exciting weekend. We got uh, the world's foremost authorities on this stage all day today, tomorrow, and then tomorrow night we'll have the shared experience of the wonderful landing. And I said to, to Charles Alachi, who's the head of the Jet Propulsion Lab, he, we were having lunch. That's how cool I am. I was having lunch with Charles Alachi, and he just kind of drifted off for a moment. And I said, he said, we're under a lot of pressure. I said, Charles, if you stop being nervous, quit doing it. And that's an old uh, theater expression. It's going to be nerve-wracking, but very exciting. So for those of you who are members of the Planetary Society, and of course, uh, planetary.org is your homepage, you know the next speaker. For those of you who are new to the Planetary Society, you, this is a guy that you may have heard exists, but you've never really seen. And he's required by our bylaws to exist. Uh, and he has become just a dear friend of mine. Ladies and gentlemen, the chairman of the board of the Planetary Society, Dan Jurassi. Good morning. Now let me also welcome you to Planet Fest 2012 and thank all of our great sponsors. Um, needless to say, this is an exciting weekend for us. Uh, if you've been to any of our other events, you know how much work goes into it. Our tireless staff uh, put so much effort into everything that happens at the Planetary Society. And I have to thank Bill specifically because Bill has brought a new energy and a new focus uh, and a new vision for where the Planetary Society will go over the course of the next several decades. Uh, don't worry, Bill, we're not holding you to 30 years in the job. Uh, but seriously, what I'd like to do, though, is just take one second to ask you to think beyond this room. The experience you have this weekend, take it with you and share it. I see a lot of young people here. That's the future of our country, that's the future of this planet, and that's the future of space exploration and science. And that's why Bill is doing what he's doing. Take the time to tell people about the Planetary Society. Give a gift of a membership for less than a video game that a kid will get tired of in three days. You can give a membership that lasts a year and two years, actually, with a student membership equivalent to a video game, and they'll learn something. But take the story and the message and share it. That's my only message for you today. Let's get the brain power up here and get this program started. Thank you very much. Jim Bell. It's my pleasure to introduce a dear friend and partner, Jim Bell, the president of the Planetary Society. Jim. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, Bill. Uh, I want to also welcome everybody to, to Planet Fest. What, a, what an amazing weekend this is going to be, right? How often do you land on Mars? How often do you land on Mars? Not very often, right? Uh, NASA's record, JPL's record, is six for seven. It's pretty good. That's uh, 857. If I was a baseball player, I'd be in the Hall of Fame instantly. Well, JPL's in my Hall of Fame, actually. You have to get the minimum number of bats. You've got to get a minimum number of bats. That's a good point. Um, <laughs> this is a hard thing. It's a hard thing. And, um, and, and it's going to be great to share it 
uh, all together. You're going to hear this uh, today and tomorrow a whole bunch of presentations about uh, the science of why we explore Mars and other planets, about the engineering and the, the technology and the hurdles that have to be overcome to do this thing, uh, landing spacecraft on another world. Um, you know, you watch these seven minutes of terror video and it looks easy, right? <laughs> it's not easy. It's some of the hardest things, these are some of the hardest things that our species does and it's some, some of the things that we should be most proud of that we explore other worlds. Uh, so, um, so again, I, I want to welcome everybody here. Take the, take the time, as, as Dan mentioned, to, to soak this in and think about how you can take this beyond this room and share your passion for space exploration with you know, kids, with the teachers, with your neighbors, friends, family members, because uh, we're all in this together. We're part of a society that loves this stuff. And this is like a rock concert for us this weekend. This is going to be absolutely spectacular. Uh, I'll be running back and forth to, uh, to JPL. I'm a member of the, the camera team on the Curiosity rover. Um, so uh, I will be, uh, tomorrow night, I'll be with my colleagues, my science team colleagues uh, on the lab at, at uh, JPL. I'll be trying to uh, give some updates from there along with uh, Emily Lakdawalla, who you all know from her great blog. She keeps us all up to date on things that are going on. And so um, I'm looking forward to sharing my own enthusiasm, excitement. Just so you know, I'm 100% confident. I have absolute faith that this is going to work. And faith is the key word. Uh, <clears throat> um, and it's, it's going to be spectacular. So um, welcome again. Thank you, members. Thank you, sponsors. Uh, thank you, uh, Planetary Society staff and our volunteers walking around in their blue t-shirts. A lot of people came together to make this happen. and. Um, and, uh, and welcome. Let's turn it back over to Bill.